Hi, I'm Naveen Surupaneni and I specialize in treatment of gastrointestinal disorders. I have completed my general gastroenterology and hepatology training at the Medical College of Wisconsin and advanced therapeutic endoscopy training at the University of Texas Health Science Center, San Antonio. I am interested in the diagnosis and treatment of all digestive health disorders and specialize in performing endoscopic procedures such as upper endoscopy and colonoscopy. Today, I would like to take a few minutes to talk about a less known but increasingly common liver disease called non-alcoholic steatohepatitis or commonly known as fatty liver disease. As the name suggests, it is a disorder where fat tissue gets built up in the liver causing inflammation and damage to the liver and can happen even in people who do not drink alcohol or drink very little alcohol. It is commonly associated with obesity, diabetes, high cholesterol and use of certain medications. Most patients that I see with fatty liver disease do not have any symptoms. Most commonly, it is diagnosed by abnormal liver enzyme elevations noted on routine blood work or on abdominal ultrasound done for some other reason. Additional tests such as viral hepatitis markers are needed to rule out other causes of liver test abnormalities before making this diagnosis. It is important to talk to your doctor for regular checkups since fatty liver can sometimes lead to serious scarring of the liver called cirrhosis. Cirrhosis can cause different symptoms such as swelling in the legs, trouble breathing, or feeling tired and is potentially life-threatening. Finally, let us discuss how this condition can be treated. At this time, the only evidence-based treatment is diet and exercise. In addition, medically supervised treatment of obesity, diabetes, and high cholesterol, if present, are paramount in getting this condition under control. Multiple research trials are currently ongoing to better understand this condition and treat this due to its increasing prevalence. As always, prevention is better than cure, so healthy diet and daily exercise can help prevent your liver from getting damaged with fatty infiltration. Please follow up with your healthcare provider to discuss the latest research trials and treatment for this condition.